That moves us to the candidate for the dues. Thank you, Mr. Chairman. Um, good evening again, Commissioners. <clears throat> and related, related to the Southside Library Project, there will be private fundraising along with these lost funds that the county has committed that you all just approved for the architect. There's a million dollars that will also be needed to finish that project. So, um, Lowndes County staff has prepared letters that we will send to our legislative delegation, and then we're coordinating with Senator Russ Goodman to move that forward. So, as we move into the session, um, certainly between now and the end of the year, whenever we talk to the delegation, we want to continue to support that project. Um, we have some of those plans. Um, certainly, Commissioner Evans is up to speed on that project, so if you'd like more information, let us know. Uh, in addition, the governor has announced $1,000 per employee to public safety members um, for local governments across the state. We have zero details from the state on that as of yet, but that portal opens October 1st, so we've got staff standing by to figure out exactly what that means, how that money is supposed to be transferred to those employees. Some of the concerns that we currently have are retirement contributions and the county's 7.25% uh, of FICA that are not budgeted. So if we need to make an adjustment there, we'll be back before you for with that information. Um, also, ABM is moving forward. They have begun the installation of new water meters for commercial customers. They won't begin on residential customers until all the software that we've discussed is in place so that those customers have that dashboard view. Um, but working through this process with our commercial customers is a little different, so we have a plan for that and that is started. Um, we have a groundbreaking scheduled on the shooting range cover for the Sheriff's Office. Um, this is the range that's located behind the LAS in Lake Park. And that's scheduled for Monday, October the 4th at 10 a.m. Um, we also have two teams that are scheduled to participate in Rotary's Corporate Cup Challenge on Friday afternoon on the grounds of the historic courthouse. I know that several of you are Rotary members, so we're excited. Um, two years ago, whenever we were able to hold um, the, the corporate challenge there under the direction of Ashley Ty, the fire department actually won. So we are um, we're at holding that winning streak there. And then I save the best for last. Um, Chief Green was notified this morning by ISO that after additional review, Lowndes County Fire Rescue has maintained our ISO rating of 4-4X. You may have seen the preliminary information that had us moving a point in the wrong direction. Um, we provided additional detail um, and that new rating is being published to our local insurance company. So we, we, we move forward that the next step will be whenever we meet with you in November for our, our retreat, we will have studied that report and provided some additional information for things that we might want to roll into the next budget process that will continue in lowering that ISA rate. Good. Thank you. Good. 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 Good